before we get into this video, um, sh big shout out, huge shout out to OBS for disabling both of my audio sources and not recording a single bit of audio for 40 whole minutes. Big shout out to OBS for that one. I really appreciate it. With that out of the way, uh, I'm here to recap what happened in the 40 minutes that you guys missed. So Luke at me gets sworn in. You know, Phoenix is like, um, you know, you know, you're not getting this verdict yet, my nigga. Uh, that's gonna give you an alibi for the murder you committed, and that me is like, oh no, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I, I've been in the uh, other courtroom for the past since since ten o'clock this morning, and things like, all right, well, bullshit. Uh, testimony time. Then we get to Atme's testimony, and and one of his uh one of his statements in the testimony is him saying uh, a photograph contains no words, but in this case, one that turned out to be my witness, and. Phoenix is like, fuck, you know, I, I'm, I'm so terrible at doing this. Then it, get, it leads us to uh, saying that there's something funny about the picture because, you know, at me is like, oh, I didn't tamper with it. I can't tamper with a picture. That uh, also, you know, that should mean I didn't kill Kane Bullard. And Phoenix is like, fuck no, uh, there, there's something wrong with this picture, my nigga. And then. Amy's like, oh, show you, so you saying I'm pussy? And Phoenix is like, you bet I am. Uh, there's something, there's something in this photo that doesn't match my memory of that night. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then Phoenix points to like the blood stain on the uh, on the right, or the, the the cum splotch on the right. And Judge is like, the fuck? And Phoenix is like, yeah. And then Phoenix is like, something else supposed to be there. That's not the paint stains. And then you're supposed to present. And then after that, you're supposed to present the Ami Faye statue that was in the warehouse. And then Phoenix, you know, <coughs> there's a flashback. <coughs> there's a flashback to when. <coughs> there's a flashback to when. There's a flashback. There's a flashback. There's a flashback to when Andrews said, "Oh, um, um, um." Um, the, the golden statue just happened to arrive from the mountain training hall, and then she was like, it would be the perfect size for covering up the paint stains, and that's why she put it there, and then, you know, because, you know, she was the one that spilled the strip, and then Phoenix was like, if this photo was taken on that night, that statue should have still been there, and then God was like, but I went there the day after, the statue of the old bag was sitting in the corner, <clears throat> And then God was like, can you prove the rock? Can you give us a reason why the statue was moved? And then Phoenix is like, yeah, why did they move it? And the judge, you know, that leads us to the judge asking, well, Mr. Wright, who was the one that moved the golden statue? And that is where the actual video starts. Once again, I apologize for the audio messing up, but you know, nothing I can do about that will be us a bitch. Anyways, the one who moved the statue is none other than Luke at me. Come now, sir lawyer. There you go again on your strange delusions. Mr. Wright, what basis do you have for your strange delusions? Um, it's quite simple. My dear Watson, the witness was the only one in the basement warehouse that night. What an alley? Oh, fuck. That is indeed very simple. However, mm, why would I want to move a heavy golden statue? Your reason for moving the gun statue. Here's where our battle really begins. Well, Mr. Wright, what reason did the witness have to move that statue? The reason can be found here in this photograph. To make the photograph not look fake. You got me. You pretended to be mask to mask to create an alibi by showing you were at Laura Lee Taylor that night. Hmm. But the photograph contains a single fatal flaw. If the statue had been there, your lie would be exposed like cheap film at a drugstore. This is why you had to move the statue. A single fatal flaw? Interesting theory. Please enlighten us. Just where in this picture does this lie exist? Is it the box? <laughs> 
though. You know what I'm saying, man? Like, I mean, it doesn't hurt to give it a try, you know I mean, we have, like, practically two chances before a game over, so let's be absolutely sure. Um, well, hold on. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. We already handled the paint. I mean, uh, hmm. So he's saying that he pretended to have stolen it. I mean, the box that has the urn on it should be dirty as fuck. That's all I have to say. Ooh, I'm raw as hell. What um, what time did this happen again? Zero fifty-eight. It's supposed to happen at one a.m. We pointed the time and said. No, oh, no, man, oh, no, man. I'm not gonna do that. Enjoy really two minutes, two, three minutes earlier, bro. What do you think, dude? I think you might be onto something. I mean, I guess the time's more obvious than the box, so, yeah. What Yo, was the question again? Like... Where's the... Where's the weird thing in this photo? That was hidden by the statue. That was hidden by the that statue? That was hidden by the statue. Oh, what, what was the question again? Then? No, all he said was there was a fatal flaw, but what we're saying was that he, um... That he was, you know, on this... The mask shit, you know, being like, oh, well, I took this. He moved the, the, the joint, uh, the statue, so it didn't uh, Wait, look like... Wait, why would like... the statue hide the time? I don't think he hit the time. The time is on the camera. What does he benefit from moving the statue that's in this picture? The, the existence of the paint? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So the box then, right? Well, I don't think. Oh, yeah, no, you yeah, know yeah, what I mean? No one else has brought up the time whatsoever, and they keep saying it happened at the same time. So. Yeah, I don't think it's the time. Yeah, they keep saying it's happened at the same time, but it's not the same time. I think they're, like I said before, I think they're. According to the again. photo. Hmm. Well. I just know that they haven't, clearly, those niggas haven't been staring at the paint or the box. So, I think it's the box. I guess. Foiled again. There I am. Yes. The lie. It's Master Mask. I was not even saying the box. Are you saying this is Ma the Master Mask is a fake? Oh. Well, I guess we're right you know, I really wish she would start acting more responsibly. You said what, bro? I didn't hear you. The going. current question is, why was the golden statue moved? So what possible connection could there be with Master Mass identity? Oh, N-words. Your face says, oh, N-words written all over it. That's a penalty for you. No slurs yeah, in my courtroom. <laughs> so we're trying good, good looking out, Judge. You know my racial ways. Rather. Okay, it's time for me to start working overtime. All right. You weren't working overtime before? No. Anyways. Uh, Careful, or you might get a game over. Jesus Christ, guys. But no worry, you got it. 100%. Total confidence. I mean... It was definitely hiding the paint, you know what I'm saying? That's the most logical conclusion. So, d please tell me we don't have to touch the paint again, right? And then he's gonna bring up the box. And how the, p the paint splashes a different shape, and they're just beating around the bush, and we've been wasting our whole time. I love pedantics. But, okay, but wait, 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 the reason he moved the statue, what? 
And that pain is <sighs> God damn it, I really thought it was on to someone with that time, bro. Like, I mean, like maybe he took maybe he took the picture. Now he had to have taken the picture before whatever happened really happened. Because mm -hmm. he set it up. Did he set it up? Or or did Andrews have that? If we're trying wait, the to statue? Set up the camera? Picture. The cameras. This camera. Picture. Well, the camera automatically takes a picture whenever someone walks by or something like that, right? So obviously, you know, if he's the person who killed the guy, he would want to take it sometime at the night so it could be forged. The question is, why did he, why, what reason does he have to move the thing? What does he gain from moving that? The only oh, thing I can think that, of is that the paint would be revealed on the floor. And I thought that, you know, the paint would lead to the box, but, you know, I guess. Or the box would lead to the paint, or the other way around. That's the only thing I can think of. Cause I have a feeling that like the time <laughs> why haven't they brought up like, the time why hasn't the time come up earlier no I one feel like maybe it's because it's negligible said... but yeah I, I feel like it would be pretty negligible to say oh I stole something at 058 and then killed someone at 1 a.m. Yeah, I guess, but I mean, we've had many times where the, the slight difference in time was important. Well, I'd say 15 minutes or 30 minute time different is pretty non-negligible. But I mean, I don't see what the statue would hide the time. Like, could the statue hide the time on that picture? No, it's not going to hide it because it's on the camera itself. Yeah, so I don't think the time's important because the statue, you know, it's not associated with the statue. Well, what do y'all think it is? It's probably the paint. That's my educated guess. I mean, I don't literally can't see what else it could be besides that, so... You agree, Tables? Whatever, dude. I don't know what's it. There's just so many signs for me that's just leading to like, that nigga here. just not being here, man. I, I guess it's just. Out of line, the photo is somewhere around here. Jumping to conclusions again, I think you need to take a look. I think you need to take a gander in your local mirror. As the Yiddish proverb goes, a half truth is a whole lie. Yiddish. Keep lying like this and you'll be the one on trial. Damn. Man, they call me a liar? They crazy, oh, that bro. Was That's enough. Nah. <laughs> this court sees no reason to prolong this orgy. Or <laughs> is there need for more time to decide this? Fuck it, nigga, you lost. <laughs> Rip Bozo. He's guilty. Fuck it. Screw the other dude, though. He's free. The accused will surrender Our the court immediately to be held at the pending trial at a higher court. Get the fuck out of my car, nigga. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you can say. Dum 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 stupid. Well, let's try the time, man. Well, good news for you guys that you get a hint. Ooh, we activating the super guide? Unless you don't want it. I don't want it. You don't want it? Can we can we save it for a later time? No. <laughs> you either want it now. They don't or roll either, over. You either want and it now or you never get it. And give us the hint. Does everyone else want that? Yeah, take it. I want it. Might as well have it if we're not gonna have it any other time. Hold on, I can I can make this clever. They prob they probably already know the answer, but uh, it's a pretty strong hint. Go ahead and give it. Go ahead and give it. All right, this is probably just gonna completely give it away, but I'm Make gonna it. say it anyway. <laughs> whatever, whatever. <laughs> it's a clever hint, though. <laughs> All right, so think about the five W's: who, what, where, when, and why. Do not focus on what. So it's the time then? 
Let's let's point at the fucking clock, dude. Do you agree, Darian? Yeah. Let's just do it, bro. It's not the clock. I have no idea. Naturally, the lies in this the photo is a timestamp. Bro, are you telling me these niggas really didn't look at the clock in the game? What do you mean? I'll tell you exactly what I mean. A night in question, the at me went to KB security and murdered Kane Bullard. Therefore, it's obvious. It would have been impossible for him to have been at Lordly Taylor at this time. Oh, yeah, because... But, oh, damn, what minutes to, away. but what does that have to do with the statue being moved? That's what I was stuck on. <laughs> Remember, if you will, Your Honor. Jesus Christ. When was the statue placed besides the warehouse door? Well... The statue was taken down to the warehouse on the day of the cry. And it was placed there in order to cover up the paint. <gasps> oh, nigga. Okay. What? Exactly. That means it wasn't there. He did that shit, like, days before. Look at me, had already decided on the time when he was going to kill the victim. And so in order to create an alibi for that time, he took this picture days before the murder took place. Oh. We love premeditation. What the? It adds to the charges. Of course, of course, the statue hadn't yet been brought down to the basement warehouse yet. Ah. So on the day of the crime, Mr. Emmy must have been quite nervous. As nervous as a long-tailed cat in a rocking chair factory, so to speak. Why? Because something that wasn't supposed to be there had been brought down in place where it wasn't supposed to be. For him, at least. And that is, on job. is why Luke at me had to move the statue on the night of the murder. He did it to make the room match the way it had been in a photo. Go ahead. Uh, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm one not sure I'm following. <laughs> Alright, so basically... Yeah. He took the picture days before. The day, right. like literally the day of the murder, like, bef like before the night time, they put that statue where it would be if he took the picture on that day. So when it was there, he was like, oh fuck, I gotta move it. But because we saw the statue there before, it and we had Adrian say that she put it there. Yeah, it was like, oh shit. That's a grade A contradiction right there. <laughs> order, order, Mr. Abby, is this true? One moment, Your Honor. H have you forgotten me? <laughs> What's that? The data for the basement warehouse computer. According to this, the camera did indeed go off on the night of the crime. Oh, you have to take pictures then. It's true that the camera had been set up by the Lordly Taylor and st uh, staff. However, the program used to manage the data uh, was yours. That alone would have allowed you to tamper with the data. Ah! Ah! <laughs> order! Order! Perfectly. Mr. Godot, what is the meaning of this? Everything's cutting out for me right now. Godot, I warned you about making me wait. Now put that coffee down. No! I don't wanna! My 11th <laughs> cup. Oh my god. I've promised to drink no more than 17 during a trial. Bruh, how is he still alive? Which means, I'm still good to the last drop. However, the defense has made a very good point. A good point? So what? We are all but travelers on a road of infinite points. Is his heart going to be rendered useless by age 40? Mm -hmm. uh, I think he got his points mixed up with his other points. So you say this photograph was taken ahead of time. And the statue was moved in order to make it match. That's a very interesting idea. However, there's one point that can't be denied. Which is? That it is only a possibility. Men that are trapped by the chains of maybe 
can never reach their dreams. That's, That's very what I'm true. Saying. No way, don't fall for that, nigga. Hey, Mr. Damask. Yes? If there's no funny business in your actions as Master Mask, Sorry. then there should be no problem with you telling us your strategy. So let's hear it. Yes, please provide this court with your testimony about your plan to steal the sacred urn. Mm -hmm. The sacred urn. Talk your shit, X. I first received the request from Lordly Taylor about 20 days ago. The urn was placed in a box, and Zavari! It was then sent to the warehouse. Hence, I was on. Hence, I was actually unable to see the urn for myself until the day of the crime. I knew it was an extremely valuable treasure, so I sent my car ten days beforehand. I then handled security by myself to ensure that my crime would go smoothly. At last, I held the urn in my hands for the first time at 1 a.m. on October 12th. Well, I already know what it is. That's pretty much all stuff we heard before, isn't it? Yeah. We will find the truth hidden in the nuggets and new information he gave. Witness, you're sure there are no mistakes this time? Zavari! Very well then, Mr. Wright, you may begin your you may begin your cross examination. Alright, let me throw hey, some here because y'all can't ignore me again. <laughs> Maybe the famous phrase I first received the request from Lovely Taylor about twenty days ago. Okay. I was uh what is what does Aaron say? I'm uh I'm uh I was too advanced for what the game wants. He said that he placed the card ten days before the shit. He never looked at it until the night of the crime. When was the shit broken? When did it, when did it break and they put in the, the pink splotches? I don't remember. I forgot when exactly she said it was broken, but uh... I just know that we couldn't see the paint at one point, then we could after the crime, so... so they placed that card ten days before this, the pink shit, the, the shit wasn't there then. Got him, GG's. Alright, so let me figure out where I'm gonna put this. You can't be saying that you carried the whole thing, because we were right about the paint. I didn't say that. <laughs> did you you never say when, that. when did I say that? <laughs> you said, got him, GG's, bruh. That's not I'm talking what about this Lord knows bastard. Okay, anyways, uh, what were you saying? Because I wasn't paying attention. Oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> like this. All right. Advice, so, you might want to pay attention, Darian. So you remember when I wasted everyone's time about the the the, the, card. the, the card, card, right? Yes. What did the card say? The card said, uh, "At the end, take care of it in his pink bullshit." Right. Yes. Uh, the speckled urn. There's no speckles on the shit until the pink stuff was on it. Pink stuff was on it when bastard broke the shit. Not too sure when yes, Master broke the shit, but I don't think it was ten days before, uh, before he placed the calling card because he said just now in his testimony that he placed the calling card ten days ahead of time. But he also said that he never looked at it. He never even looked at it until the day of the crime. Never saw the the urn until the day of the crime where he supposedly stole it. Those twenty right. days he known he was supposed to protect it. All right. Yep. That's true. The tables is correct. So what do we do? Uh, so go back. <coughs> go back one more time. Alright, uh, let's go to the right. Yes, sir. Everyone's place to go to the right. Look to the right. And shall we go to the right? There you go. Uh, you use the card there. Awesome gamer shit. Oh, so we're not press pressing anything? And... We got we got pressures. He got a, he got storage to maintain. All right, exactly. We can save the video Let's go. We're going balls. We got storage in. to you maintain. You don't have to worry. We got, we got three speed times run time. Oh, okay. so what's one more game over? Game over, shame yep. over. Can we save <laughs> before we do this? No. Okay, go ahead and press it. 
or do it, present it to me. Mm-hmm. Spitting mad facts. What's that mean? If you really are mask the mask. And you also wrote this calling card, correct? Well, of course. Is there a problem with that calling card? Shut up. Allow me to read a passage from the, the scripture of uh, Revelations for you, my, my dear. From Take the good care of the speckled urn. Now, the speckled urn here surely refers to this pink pattern on the sacred urn. Yes, that is true. So what? Nod. Truth be told, there is no way the Master Mask could have known about this pattern. What do you mean? This pink spotted pattern on the urn is actually nothing more than paint stains. Paint stains? And these stains did not appear until after the urn had been taken to Loyalty Taylor. <laughs> I'm not finding this joke to be very funny, Mr. Trite. Today, that sacred urn was taken to the warehouse. Hello. The urn was broken due to human error, or should I say, an error prone human. Well, I forgot you yeah. dropped the paint. And that's when the pink paint got on the urn. Ugh. You. You can't be serious. Tables with the carry. Don't say that. And yet, this <laughs> calling card clearly mentions the pat paint pattern. Which means. Detective Admi had seen this uh, urn long before the crime ever took place. In fact, Toys, he saw it when this fake photo was taken. He <laughs> and because this photo is a fake, the alibi for the night of the murder no longer holds water. <laughs> Squidward crying in the mirror. Squidward crying. <laughs> Squidward crab rape. Witness, do you have anything to say for yourself, bitch? <laughs> say it. Let the viewer <laughs> demonetize right, my video. Um, Nick, I think it's a little still too early for a sweet victory. I hate women, bro. <laughs> What's up? Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> oh, that's the best. It's so sad. No one has any conviction these days. Conviction? You say? Yesterday, we all decided unanimously this Could man was mass to mass. And now, we're calling him a murderer. Yeah. You don't think we're being a tad fickle? That's a good point. This nigga said that, that is a good point. Don't fall for that too, your honor. You say that Luke Adamy was the one who killed Kane Bullard? Then let me ask you this. Why would he do that? Oh my gosh, Moses. <laughs> an excellent point. Motive, Mr. Right Motive! Might you have my Merry Murderous Motive manifest? I'm surprised I got that on the first try. Nice alliteration. <laughs> if he prepared an alibi and pinned this crime on Ronda Light, as you say, he must have had a very strong motive for murder. The only one with any murder we've seen Motives. is Ronda Light. Fuck! <laughs> Isn't that right, detective? Indeed. According to my own research, the boy's motive is clear. Without a motive, it's nearly impossible to prove guilt in a murder case. Now then, maybe you can enlighten us as to what the defendant's motives were? I'd be honored to, Sir Oldtimer. They're doing everything they can to make Ron look suspicious. Despite our lack of hard information, this may be our only chance. Motive for murder. I, Luke Atney, had no points of contact with the victim whatsoever. Kane Buller decided to investigate Master Mask and simply mistook who he was. 
It was Mr. Bullard who wrote the blackmail letter and sent it to Rhonda Light. And it was again Mr. Bullard who harbored a grudge against Mr. Delight for his betrayal. Mr. Bullard's mistake is quite excusable. The defendant truly believes he is Master Mask. That is why Mr. Delight saw it fit to kill Mr. King Bullard. Truly a tragedy. All right. So the victim, Kane Bullard, blackmailed the defendant? This is the blackmail letter found in the defendant's apartment. A handwriting test confirms that Mr. Bullard was indeed the one who wrote the letter. What? Found in Rondo Light's room, written by Bullard. Phoenix like, man, why can't we get those? Very well, Mr. Wright. Begin your cross-examination. Oh, I thought they gave us that the little newspaper thing. Or am I tripping? They did. They did. Go look. Oh, oh, where they doing that? Look, right there. No, I thought it was another one. All right, we got to look it up. <coughs> no, I see. Okay, well, uh, okay, go back. <laughs> Let me get a better look at that little blackmail letter. If you don't want your true identity revealed to the world, come to KB Security at 1 a.m. on October 12th and bring $5,000. If you don't- $50,000. If you don't take, if, if you don't take, if, you saying that really take. fucked me up, I'm not gonna lie. If you don't take. I don't know why. <laughs> How? I don't know, I don't know, because you made me relook at that and I was like, did I say that wrong? But whatever. If you don't, uh, I'll take that red diamond you received the other day. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Go, back. <laughs> Go back. Go back twice. Go to the right. Go to the right. I feel like either the judge or no, nah, maybe the judge just doesn't read. The judge doesn't read. Go to present. I said we put the black mail on that. Yeah. Darian. One hundred percent, bro. The judge isn't in, in possession and, of I mean, the evidence, I Faith. Yeah. Oh. But the lawyers present the evidence to the judge. Because oh, that's not so. that's not the judge's job. <laughs> hey, let's do a little quick interview. You feel me? Look at tables with the hard carry. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> She's really trying to jinx. I prefer me dead. <laughs> <laughs> well, if it's just a, a few, I guess it's all right. When you said that this letter was addressed to Rondo, like... <laughs> this nigga be like, are you telling the truth? I can not help but notice one major contradiction. Yeah, I'm only one. I found a couple mm, interesting things. Contradiction? I don't know where a walking contradiction like you gets off saying things like that. Are you calling me a walking L? <laughs> you don't want to talk. At times like these, men are made to express themselves with their fists. Oh, so you want to fight? <laughs> so why don't you show us what you got there, Junior? Indeed, time to man up, Mr. Wright. The fuck? Show us the contradiction nigga. evident. Show it, show it. Nigga. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> Contradict. Um. Okay. But. I don't know. I don't know to show. I... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, don't, I didn't think I'd get All this far. Right. Fight back, <laughs> nigga. Look at the look at the wait, look wait. at the blackmail letter real quick. Wait, we don't present that again, do we? I, I feel like I said like Look at it. Okay. I'll take that red diamond. You know, he doesn't have the red diamond. Just give it back. And I, I guess you present a profile? Mm-hmm. No. I don't think we present a profile here. Go back. What, we looking at Ron's profile? No, no, no profiles. Go to the right, uh, like the the right page. The wallet. Oh. Um. Yo, card. Yep. <clears throat> newspaper. Let me look at the newspaper again. Gem of the tier of Amazon looks blue to me. No. Uh, 
That is, a, that is a blue. It's a blue. That's not the same thing he's talking about. No, he's talking about the ring on his finger, obviously, right? Oh. Mm, I don't think so anymore. He's seeing yeah. the contradiction. He didn't talk about we can't show the fucking ring. But if this gym is blue, I'm thinking it has something to do with him thinking because what's it called? Because Master Mass stole this shit too. Hmm. Mm. I think we show that. I'm red and blue. Yes. Honestly. Go ahead. Faith. Yeah. What the hell is going on? I put that shit on you, nigga. You have a tie as fuck there. Take a good look at this newspaper clipping. It contains a picture of the tier three sub, the stolen jewel. Ooh, what about it? Well, you see, the problem is this jewel's color. Now. Relax, okay. I'm not a Republican <clears throat> here, but color. I'm not much of a for discussing color myself. Oh, you're racist. Robots, robots don't believe in race. How does that make? <laughs> no, like a robot. <laughs> you According know how to... it's like. <laughs> it's legally no, it's, it's, it's the same Ben Shapiro argument. I don't want to talk about politics. That's course... not what he said, dumbass. Anyways, continue. Politics. <laughs> I agree with. to the cliffing. The color of the stolen jewel is blue. But, man, you know what he, he, he applying, you know what I'm saying? I don't know shit about that nigga, I'm just saying. Anyway, <laughs> however, in the blackmail letter, a totally different jewel is mentioned. I'll take that red guy. Me, 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 some gay shit. Red? Yes, we ain't even talking about Cardi. Okay. With that, I believe the red diamond described in the blackmail letter. Is not the tier of Emanon the Master Mask stole at all. Okay, nigga, and. Objection. Mr. And your Epstein. point is, Mr. Trite? You're gonna call me by my name. So, are you trying to say that this blackmail letter was intended for someone else? Bruh. That's what you're trying to say, right, Trite? That's what you're trying to say, right, <laughs> Mr. Trite? <laughs> Well, is that what you're trying to say? Okay. okay. <laughs> Man, he got a lot of names. Trite, right, Nick. Oh god. Yeah, I was gonna say about her. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's who hit me, but it was actually blackmailing. Bruh, fucking retard. Go, go to prison. <laughs> Tell me yeah. Yeah. And I'll present a mask the mask. Oh! God, bruh. Oh god, I'm bruh. Pro oh god, god bruh. Yeah. To do next, let me talk about gumshoe. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, look at me. Yep. No, 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 no. Look at me. Look at me. Go to, go to, look um, at me. Go to Ron. Go to Ron. <laughs> look at me. No, not Ron. Oh shit! My bad. I was thinking about him. Thinking about men. Bing bong boom. Detective at me. <laughs> Do you have some sort of basis for that claim? <laughs> that red Based ring on what? Red... <laughs> I've been personally involved in every single mask the mask case. Is, is, am I right or am I right? And in the last case, you recovered what was stolen. Awesome. You know what I'm saying? And received a jewel as your reward. Uh, a jewel? A jewel? A jewel. One containing the ultimate power. Probably the one uh, wrapped con conspicuous. Con 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 I don't know why. I don't God. know why. <laughs> I know what it said, but I'm like, bro. Anyway. It's because I want to bring up how TikTok, when you use um, the, the text to speech, when it says rapping, when you spell rapping, for some reason it says the R word. Anyways, that red diamond <laughs> ring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's pronounced Nick. Oh, this is the diamond <laughs> word in the letter. Which means that the King Bullard wrote that letter in order to blackmail you. You. <laughs> order. Order in the court. Um, order. I Shut the fuck up. It seems you've gone too far uh. with your. Childish pranks, I can't wait Mr. Trite. Who's, who's the water boy that keeps passing on them coffees? Me. No, I don't know. No, I, don't, I don't like that the way he said that. Not like God himself. Pain Bullard. 
blackmailing Luke at me? Yes. Are you for real? No, yes. I'm yes. Um, yes. Yes. Figment of your imagination, Godot. Nick, come on. Me stand that up for me. Don't, don't your pussy out. God, then damn, answer I... me this. Oh, man, it's just drinking fucking gasoline. My <laughs> <name>. like... <laughs> Nigga drinking tar. <laughs> the blackmail letter contains the following passage. I like that my coffee, such a Ebony. Terrible. <laughs> if you don't want your identity revealed to the world, yes, it certainly I'm does. What as little rights as possible. The tea baby. Kane Bullard threatened to make Luke Atmin's identity public knowledge. I don't know why Kane's face coming up on the screen when you said that tables made that funny. <laughs> 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 An identity he wanted to keep a secret. So just what was that identity? Lord, um, well, if the black, Atme <clears throat> killed the Kane Bullard because he was afraid of his secret becoming known. What was the identity he wanted to keep secret? Master Mask? That's what it all comes down to, Nick. The identity that Luke had me wanted to do so desperately keep secret wanted so desperately to keep secret was his identity as he males people i'm just kidding i'm just kidding <laughs> don't fold well clearly he doesn't want to keep you know he doesn't care about the fact that everyone knows he's the best detective ever so it has to be mass to mass is that a joke faith no <laughs> <laughs> Hypothetically speaking. Run it through your head again, Faith. Bro, just click on Master Mass. No one's saying anything! <laughs> <laughs> Probably should think this one through, as if you get it wrong, it's game over. Again. Game over, blame over. When was the last time? Shut up. I mean, no one okay. cares about the fact, like, what kind of, what, why would the carrot keep a secret about being a blackmailer? Whoa. Well, actually, maybe. I feel like I'm, I'm going too far with this thought I just had. Oh, I'm back, like, Yo, you weren't <laughs> even here for that? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was here for the question. Uh... <clears throat> My niggas. <laughs> but yeah, I was gonna. I was originally saying Master Mask, and then I was like, but what if he, you know, he wanted to keep his secret as a blackmailer because Ron gets blackmailed all the time? That's what I'm saying! Yes. Do you agree, Darian? I disagree, because if you were to pick the third option, we would lose uh, all depression. our health. Okay. Pick the third option, please. That is yes, bad. I mean, I did, I did just remember, I get reminded that uh, Ron do be talking to niggas. I'm not sure who those niggas are, though. Bro, Ron gets blackmailed every single day of the week, dude. That took a long ass time for no day. reason. <laughs> he did. <laughs> I, I thought y'all yeah. niggas had it. I was like, bro. <laughs> My niggas. And, and Terry didn't say anything. No, that's, saying... that's what. Never mind. I'm never gonna say that. No, here, go everyone was silent except for Faith. I was like, "Come on." Duke Dennis was a blackmailer. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga looks Dennis. nothing like Duke Dennis. Hey, now, isn't that a little bit different from what you've been saying? Yes. You said that Kane <laughs> Bullard was the one blackmailing Luke at me. I'm just thinking of a drawn Duke Dennis just smiling like the baby <laughs> on here, bro. Like, this shit killing me. Alright, alright. Black man. Are you saying. Shut. <laughs> you do kind of remind me of the baby a little bit. Sorry, that was reflexive. Are you saying that Luke, that at me, was blackmailing someone else on top of that? You have to admit, that does sound weird. Whose side are you on? You're fired. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna survive without me, nigga. Nigga, you're a damn leech. Go away. Exactly. It's not odd. It's the only thing that makes any sense. Win. 
King Blood was blackmailing Luke at Tamimi. But Ronda Lai was also being blackmailed by a certain someone. It's a triangle. So, did you start receiving blackmail letters after this incident, or like, am I tripping? Yes, just a few days after the Tier of Eminon heist. After that, I started getting the plans in the mail. I received plans from some very kind person, incredibly detailed plans. Detailed plans? In which case, that would mean Ron Delight was actually Master Mask. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Someone else came up with the plan set and had Mr. D. Light uh, steal his targets for him. Uh, say. And that someone was none other than Luke at me. That bitch got 40 money. Silence. Silence. <laughs> <laughs> now I see. It's all becoming clear. It's all coming together. What is? You're in when you were in grade school, we received the same report card every year. Bullshit. Was all yes. no. With the tendency to jump to conclusions. Am I wrong? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? You think about to have PTSD? You say that I, look at me, was blackmailing Rhonda Light? In which case, I will let you in. But, in which case, I will naturally know all about his relation to Mask the Mask. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, Ronda Light started receiving plans from his second crime onward, correct? <laughs> Which means I learned of his identity when he committed the first crime. Good point. You certainly couldn't have blackmailed him otherwise. <laughs> In that case, let's see some hot, bitter evidence. Right. During it's the first it. crime, how did Luke at me know that Ronda Light was Master Mask? Can we present that newspaper again? Damn. I want ass so bad. Me too, bro. Uh, yeah, sure. Yo, <laughs> I'd like that too. That'd be nice. Damn. Okay. <clears throat> Wait, hold on. Can't say I'm a fan of that, so... Look at it again. I am... Bro. Well, I mean... What? Okay. Yeah, present it. <laughs> what? Bro, what the heck is this? Hold on. I think I see it. <laughs> Stevie I see Wonder. It. I, I see, see it. it, Stevie. I see it. See what? When you were in grade school, you received the oh. same report card every year. Talking shit. Gets into lots of mischief trying to be the center of attention. Ooh. Oh, uh, what do you mean? He hard for that one. <laughs> This, ain't, uh, this, this new page, this, this shit, right here, you see that? If you were to look closely, there's a picture of you in Ron Delight in this guard uniform. It seemed the Master Mask didn't just disappear into thin air. Unless you are God. <laughs> kind of just took up self <laughs> and, and hidden, hid in the bucket. That, Don't you presume? That sounds far too stupid to be true. And it is. Correct. With tricks like that, he couldn't fool a baby, let alone an ace detective. Maybe if Gumshoe was on the scene. <laughs> anyway, that's when you figured it out, Mr. Admi. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Baby on baby. Oh. Wasn't he the supposed to be Master Mask? Not only that, it looks like he wasn't even an ace detective. I can't believe it. He was just a slimy blackmailer. What a fraud, trying to pass himself off as an ace detective. He's not weird though. Slimy black He's not a bad though. In disguise. <laughs> and this shitty fucking nose. Why you? How dare you expose me like that? Look at the show. I am sweating. Fat bastard. Why I? I mean, I never blackmailed that anyone in my life. Look at spray, bro. Look at that white ass. Oh, I, I, cock I, with your nose. I'm I, I'm a famous and proud ace detective, and what also mask the mask. Tweet at me. Why can't you understand that? <laughs> I'm afraid you are either a proud thief, neither a proud thief, nor an ace detect. You're just 
You're a blackmailer and a murder. It's a true identity. Oh, 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 you! How dare you even dare to? Big mouth. Oh my gosh, the stream is lagging. Oh Ace detective cannot handle blackmail. Murder, murder. Ah. <laughs> it's enough to make one laugh. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> it would seem we finally arrive at the real answer. That was quite a performance by, uh, look at me! Did we win? Baylor, <laughs> please repair the cell for Mr. Atme. No! Object the function! Mm-mm-mm. mm mm Flea had a hit with that one, that was a sleeper. The hammer that strikes too fast has no time to aim. He already Ooh. had his freak What do you mean? That's kind of a- that's actually a bar. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm already prepared to deliver my ruling. Bruh, and it went over his head. Allow me to say one thing. I will be the one to judge. No, Imagine. Get Kill him. It's psych. You don't get much more in your face than that. Except for the whip on It appears that your claws weren't quite sharp enough, Mr. Triant. I'm not a furry. <laughs> it's true that you've proven a lot of things. Yeah, one better be the fact I'm not a fucking furry, bitch. Eddie. <laughs> Things like Luke Atme was a filthy blackmailer, and that he wasn't at Lordly Taylor the night of the murder. But was he there, though? He said. That's right. That's why he's the one who killed Mr. Bull Boulevard. But. He didn't kill him. Let's go. <laughs> There's still one thing you have yet to prove. What's that? Or your mom. Just because he wasn't at the warehouse doesn't mean he was at the murder scene. That's what I was saying. I was Therefore, saying like, if he can... <laughs> Bless you, Blue. Thanks. You gotta love Larry entering the courtroom. Let's go. <laughs> Keep talking, but don't. No. Therefore, if you can't prove that this pitiful excuse of a man was at KB Security, then I don't see how a verdict can be delivered. Well, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, GG's Ron. Order, see order in the court. Life, bro. Well, I Mr. Wright. Enjoy that 25 to life, player. None I can do. This, <laughs> this is the finale. The final countdown. I've got to prove that Atme was at Mr. Uh, Boulevard's office on that night. But can you really prove that, though? That's long enough, Mr. Trite. I want to hear your answer. Damn, bitch. That night, Luke at me was at KB Security in the defense. Oh, not one of these again. We only have three tells. And guess what's not here? The health bar. Lego. <laughs> With that being said, let's switch things up and say we can't do it. Yeah, I don't yeah. think we can do it. Yeah. What? Bruh. What? Oh, he, he chose it. Never mind. It didn't look like you chose it. My bad. You thought you chose him. I, I can't prove it. Just as I thought. What a neighbor. <laughs> but if we hear more of Detective Abby's testimony. Nah. Bruh. Unfortunately, that's as far as you go, Mr. Trot. What are you talking about? I won't allow for any more testimony. That's what I mean. Oh, so then we win. Back up. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> I <laughs> guess. We don't want him to talk no more. I mean, everything I said. Have you forgotten? Look at me here. Is here. Fuck. Look at me. Is here after we interrupted his own trial. And you have failed to prove that he committed the murder. I what? think it's time for this witness to return to his own trial. Yeah, he's not a criminal. And face his guilty verdict as Master Mask. Oh, shit. How often do niggas have seizures in the court for people to not realize this nigga's clearly guilty? You know how many mm. times niggas started mm. shaking when we got our shit <laughs> over right? That's what I'm saying. 
Well now, Same Sir Lawyer, it seems that love wins out in the end after all. I am the Ace Detective, as well as Master Mask. My verdict will verify that. Just as Ron the Lights will verify that he is the true murderer. I declare that with the full force of my East Detectiveness. That's so cool. Order, order in the court. That's enough deliberation over this witness. Man, what the fuck at this rate, Ron's done, bruh. Don't give up now, Nick. We still have tomorrow. We can look for more evidence. Bro. By then, it'll be too late. Huh? Why? What? Why is she says? Double jeopardy. One of the basic rules of any court of law. Double jeopardy? I don't play that Should game. Should a defendant be tried and found innocent in court, that defendant cannot be tried again for the same crime. It smells like OJ in here. That is literally how that nigga got off. <laughs> and it applies that to this the witness. It applies Crime's to this witness as much as it applies to everyone else. Mr. Atme will be found guilty in a matter of minutes. Guilty as mask the mask. Which means... He will be innocent as far as the murder of Kane Bullard is concerned. God, the legal system is trash. The fact that you were <laughs> unable to prove Mr. Atme's guilt of that crime here means that he will never be tried for... Never again be tried as Mr. Kane Bullet's murderer. Murder on the beat, because it's Ooh, not that nice. Sucks, <laughs> oh, that sucks. Well, Was that a game over right there? Oh. I imagine. <laughs> I sh that, that, wasn't even, like... that wasn't even fucking funny. I wasn't laughing. We lost. I lost. <laughs> I lost. Even if Ron is proclaimed to be innocent, the real killer. Man, fucking hate white people, man. <laughs> you have cross examined every statement the witness has made here today. And as long as there is no more testimony. I'm afraid I have to declare that there will be no further questioning of this witness. Are there any objections? Larry, <laughs> please. Then I hereby end the cross examination of Luke at me. The fuck? Is that what's her name? Um, the Russian bitch? Yeah. <laughs> has poor hearing and often makes mistakes as a result. Huh. How did you? <laughs> Phoenix! Shut the fuck up. Have you forgotten what I used to tell you? Oh my god, it's fucking Rhea. Uh, <laughs> oh oh yes, please let me, bing, baby. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, bro? <laughs> my, my nigga. Mia. Maya did that channeling quick. Damn. <laughs> Maya said it's clutch time. This is the truth. Maya power. said, "Oh fuck, I gotta get, I gotta go to the afterlife for help." This is the true power of the Korean channeling technique. Yes, we know. I know that it's really Maya who's standing before me. But right now, she's my mentor. Mia Faye. Right now, she's bad as shit. She's oh my, my gosh, wife. <laughs> Her nose looks stupid here. <laughs> oh. Now, let's let Lego. Um, but there's nothing more we can do, Mimi. Without <laughs> any more testimony, I can't really cross examinate. Man, shut your puny bitch ass up. The testimony's not over yet. What do you mean? Your Honor, just now you said something very interesting. You have cross-examined every statement the witness has made here today. Yes, that's true, but... Maybe bored as hell. Is heaven boring or something? 
Unfortunately, Your Honor, you're forgetting something. Earlier, after the last cross-examination, the witness made a number of remarks. Well now, Sir Lawyer, it seems that love wins out in the end after all. I am the Ace Detective, as well as Wrath the Mask. My verdict will verify that. Just as Ron the Lights will verify it, he is the true murderer. I declare that with full force of my Ace Detectiveness. Yes, but those, these comments appear to have no importance what's... Very well. Then we shall prove their importance via cross-examination. At any rate, as the witnesses made these remarks, well, I mean, we the defense assert our right to question them. Is that our ever true, Prosecutor? Jethro Tech? Is something the matter, no. Mr. Godot? No coffee? Nothing. Where'd the coffee go? Oh, sir lawyer, it looks you're one step too late. If you think such falsehoods will do anything to me, look at. Let's hear it. Huh? It's true the witness has made some remarks. So then, let's hear this last bit of cross examination. Mr. Godot, what are you? Very well then, Mr. Luke at me. I'm going to allow the defense to cross-examine your earlier remarks. The defense would like to hear why you declared the defendant to be the true murderer. So please, give us one last bit of testimony. <laughs> Phoenix, this is it. This is our absolute last chance. Yeah, alright, bro. <laughs> Bruh, we really the last scrape him by the bottom because he wouldn't shut his mouth. <laughs> Indeed, it is true that I was not that lordly tailor. I had to leave to see about another vitally important job request. I had known about the date beforehand, so I had this photograph ready. My brilliant deduction was what informed me that the true culprit was Ron the Light. And thanks to the geek card and wallet, it was abundantly clear that he was there. There we go. I was also able to make a deduction from the buzzer, which only sounded once. Ooh, the buzzer beater. The buzzer, the button did not have any fingerprints on it. Why? The victim would have left prints if he sounded it, which means the killer sounded it. Mr. Delight was wearing his master mask outfit, which is why he left no prints. And the blackmail letter? The victim lightly mistook the color of the jewel. The body! Therefore, all the evidence points to that poor boy. Alright, so that was a lot, so take your time with it. No. <laughs> it should actually seem so. You better take cool. your time because there's a little catch that comes through this, which you'll, you'll see in a moment. The one that says. Is... I can clutch and clutch on my damn. <sighs> The witness's early remarks do not appear to have been hastily prepared. All of his points have been explained, but none of them seem to contradict anything. Not of course. But, how did you know about the emergency buzzer? The police investigation documents went directly through me. And I always look over the documents. It's elementary, sir, lawyer. Fuck. Are you going to make even more trouble for us now, Sir Lawyer? I will not allow any of your usual shenanigans, Mr. Wright. Fucking usual. Yeah, all right. <laughs> we cannot postpone Luke at Me's trial any longer. This is your last chance. This is evolution. I just run the event. Hang on a sec. Just one chance. <laughs> it seems that the party is about to begin. Well, there isn't any evidence that contradicts with that testimony. So it would seem. Oh, what, 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 what do you mean, so it would seem? You gonna finish that or. Uh, we'll... Listen, Phoenix, pointing out contradictions 
doesn't always mean you have to present evidence, does it? At any rate, this is our last chance, so have fun. If you can't point out a case-breaking contradiction, just, <laughs> just quit, to be honest. Work on fishing or some shit. <laughs> Go back to art school. <laughs> cup number 17. He perked up. The last cup. It seems like the time to... It seems like the time has come to put this trial. Fuck, man, I can't read. I actually can't look at words in a text box properly. I feel that. I have to find a fatal contradiction in this testimony. <laughs> I need to point it out without presenting evidence. I just imagine Tables reading that section with his fingers on the words. <laughs> Which means all I can do is find a contradictory mark and press it. Ooh, hear that, guys? I don't want to hear anyone say to look at the court record because that is stupid as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, you only get one chance. Very well, Mr. Wright. Please begin your final. There was a TikTok like showing how TikTok makes their beans, which I already know because I worked there, but it's like, damn. What does that change? Like, It's just astronaut food. Like, Indeed, mm -hmm. it is true that I was not at Lurley Taylor. Wait, so... I know we're not allowed to present, but we're only allowed to press once, is that what they heard? Mm-hmm. Press. And if you press right. the wrong thing, you just lose. Straight up. No matter what your health is. Well, our oh, health wow. is in losing territory. So choose carefully. Oh. Can we save, though? <laughs> no. <laughs> What's the point of saving? Because we haven't what? saved in a while. Faith. If we you want to be us. saved, give your heart. To Christ. Savior, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Never mind, I'm saving. That's crazy as fuck. Anyway. Right. <laughs> I just thought that, I was making a good point. Like, I thought I was making a good point. We haven't saved in like many years. It is kind of well. I don't know. I only save if we all lose Next. health. Anyways. Next. I had to leave to see about another vitally important job request. Next. Oh I had known about the date beforehand, so I had this photograph ready. You know, guys, no oh. pressure. Next. Bro, shut the fuck up. Stop. My brilliant deduction was what informed me that the true culprit was around the light. I just wrapped it like a George Lucas. Are you sure about that, good sir? Next. Your next slide. And, that, and thanks to the key card and wallet, it was abundantly clear that he was there. Next. Oh, shoot. Key card and the wallet. I was able to form, I was able to make a deduction from the buzzer, which only sounded once. Do we know for what? a fact that the buzzer was on? Go to the right. I'll keep going to the The button did not have any fingerprints on it. Why? PJ on glove. Next. The victim would have left prints if he sounded it, which means the killer sounded it. Yeah, Ooh. whatever. Next. I think we said that. Mr. Delight was wearing his master mask outfit, which is why he left no prints. Mm-hmm. Ouch. And the blackmail letter? The victim likely just mistook the color of the jewel. Wait a minute. Oh my okay. gosh, this is a lot. Next. Next or oh, back. Next. 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 Come on. It's body. Therefore, all the evidence points to that poor boy. Oh, you're gay. Go to the left. <laughs> back. Uh, hmm. Yeah. I don't yeah, I can see that. Go to the left. I wonder how you mistake red for blue. That I was wearing tonight, right there. There is, you know, being colorblind face. There is, a, yeah, there is colorblindness. There, there's a thing. Go to the left. Well, I don't think colorblindness is what they're going for. But... Shoutouts <laughs> to Incogam. Shoutouts to Jay. Bro, what <laughs> freaking is color. <laughs> Gil, not. No bullying here. Whatever. Go to right. Except, except for bullying of Darian. That is approved. Has to do with this button. Thank mm -hmm. God. <laughs> So we can't right. even look at the court record? That's crazy. <laughs> oh god. Now Wait, I feel stupid. Look at the <laughs> now, now I feel stupid because now I kind of want to look at the <laughs> You can. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> I was about to say, what the cuss? Do we have any Bunch pictures? Bunch of folders, have, guys, I swear. Hey, hey, or... did you know that you're gay? <laughs> do we have any pictures hey. of Ron at the security place wearing the mask to mask? Or... I don't know, do we? I don't think there's any pictures of him at the security place, but I feel like there's something in this bitch that has his fingerprints on it. Ron's fingerprints? Yep. Yeah. The key card or the wallet. 
which was what brought up, then we have not presented those. Well, we're not presenting anything, but let's go back. Wait, no, 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 no don't go back, don't go back. Let's keep it moving. My bad, my bad, my bad. That was my fault, that was my fault. No, the the use the okay, why is, why is Discord Which lagging is so hard? <laughs> Wait, what's that next photo right there? Just some, Publicity photo? Just oh. mass to mass naked. Naked. <laughs> Look at the book. What is that book? What is in that book? The plans of, of the crime scene. Shout out to my main nigga Kane, man. Let's, let's see what he got going on. Let's check, see what he got going on. Tear of me to me. I wonder if it had pictures. <laughs> instead of just writing. What the fuck? Here. Have we ever looked at this? No. No. What well, this just looks like. <laughs> the fucking well, portrait of a vagina. complex shoe shopping video. <laughs> Go back. I wish we knew if that had if they had pictures so we could you know. All right. Well, if it does have his print uh, prints on shit, so we can uh, we can go back and just start coming on things. And uh, on things. I think that's the one to to call out on because I think he dirty liar here. You think he left prints? Yeah. Um, uh, I'm not sure about that. Where'd no, where? we can keep it. We can keep looking around if you over so please. I mean, Steven did say that if we pr press the wrong thing. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's why he said he Speaking thought this of was which, a uh, Steven, don't do that. Keep in mind. Please. Yeah, keep the fuck up, mind. Steven. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> keep in mind. Right, he's talking about the button here. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes, you build abnormal. Two. Yeah. Next. Uh, so, why do you. Why, why are we talking about the, the prints on the, the button? Like, what, what's going on? <laughs> What's well, going he on? said that he left no prints at all. We're looking for something to, to press on right now. Um, but what else kind of kind of kind of leads to what we've been talking we about in previous investigations? Quick? Once again, we can reread the stuff and see. You know, take a trip little check. Oh man. Yeah, no, can the CEO oh. of Buzzer. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't look at the rest Neighbor. of the evidence. Go right. Neighbor. Go right again. Go right over the campus. Buzzer record. Buzzer went off at 102. Whoa. Look right again. Ron's testimony. Oh yeah, we already know about that. I guess that's everything. All right. So we got the buzzer list. What does the wallet say? Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I remember uh, a bit butt found the wallet. Forgot. Mm -hmm. Can we uh can we press the statement yet? Are you positive? For I am, but I mean once again, we can uh you know if you wish to because we can look at the other stuff again, you know, and flip through. You know, and... Um, um, let Let's do it. What's another game over? Oh god, we saved, right? Exactly. This will, be, this will be the episode for the viewers. I know how they like seeing us fail and all that, you know. Ha ha ha. Yep, 100%. I honestly have no idea, so let's go for it, I guess. This nigga fade is just so awful. Hey, yo, bitch. I'm about this lesson work. Burn. Uh oh. Uh oh. You're wrong. You still don't get it, do you, Trot? This isn't the time to be pressing the witness on every little statement. Man, look at Dick. <laughs> I'm the one who still doesn't get it, Mr. Gado. Mr. Yeah, Garbo. Mr. Gat. Mr. Okay, Mr. Atme. Uh, no. Mr. Atme, it seems you have finally admitted. That you were in the CEO office on the night of the murder. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Uh, how can you say that? I'm standing up. I'm stance. Let me move this, <laughs> this mic up real quick. <laughs> Damn. Am I unplugging? Okay. Let's review your testimony, uh, shall we? Uh, shall we? The button did not have any fingerprints on it. Now, why is that? That's what your dumbass said. You said, mm -hmm. <laughs> Mr. Delight was written, was wearing his uh, baby on baby outfit. Is that correct? 
Um, baby, yeah. Is that what you said? <laughs> that is what I said. My deductions are absolutely foolproof. Yeah, so I've heard all fucking night. More like your deductions prove that you're a, a fool. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. Whatever do you mean? Damn. Yeah, yeah, you a fan For of some though, right? reason, you see him tonight. I'm starting to get really thirsty. Drink, all that nigga. Damn coffee is dehydrating you. Get some water. When exactly? Did we learn the fact that Ron Delight was dressed as Master Mask when he went to the scene of the crime? That was, um... It was just a few hours ago. Back when my six cup was looking at me with a cold stare. Daddy counts. Huh? Oh, did I forget to mention it before? I'm sorry, I just never had a chance to mention it until now. Right, the defendant had yet to tell anyone else this fact before this morning. Oh, never one. The only people who should know this are, are those who've been watching this trial. I've been waiting. Just throw it out, my nigga. But do you hear me? Do you hear me good? There's no way that you should have known about that. <laughs> He said, hey, yo. <laughs> hey, yo uh, you were in the next courtroom being uh, tried as mask to mask. Is this, is this fact or fiction? True or rubbish? So then enlighten us. Just how did you know about that piece of information? Hmm? Well, you see. Yeah. Um, I, I feel like slamming my fist. Almost. Right Come on. on. This detective must have known about it. He probably had plenty of chances to find out beforehand. And it's those chances that I want to discuss next. <laughs> Not the rapper. <laughs> that night, Mr. Delight was wearing that mask, this ma his master mask outfit. There is one and only one way for a detective at me to have found that up. Only one? One way, you say? Yay. Please recall, if you will, Mr. Delight's testimony. Testicles. When I entered the office, there was a suspicious shadow there. Bing, 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 bing. For a second, my client, my client saw demons. <laughs> <laughs> but Mr. Damn. Delight never saw his attacker. Okay. So there's no way to tell whether or not the real killer was Luke Atme. I bet. It's with that statement that. I'll turn T. <laughs> this case on its head. Just what are you implying? Um, Mr. Delight uh, saw the real killer, correct? Now, if you turn that statement around, it stands to reason that the real killer had also seen Ron Delight. I'm stretching. Jesus Christ, this feels good. Impossible. King Batch Security. Bing bing. Bum bum. To talk about me, you saw Master Mask at the murder scene that night. You saw him when you killed Kane Brillard and assaulted Ron Delight. That was the only way you could have known what Ron was wearing. What the fuck? Earthquake? Oh, he's about to give off an Omega Brap. Yeah, he really is. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, finally. I take a good look, everyone. I'm a racist. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to the fact that I'm a killer. Take a good look, everyone. I'm able to find a rival worthy of my genius. I was forced to create one myself. Again. Here I am, the tragic clown. That's the same one you gave yesterday. Yeah, man. But I think there's a little more meaning behind it this time. The <laughs> fake ass redestro. I don't know what that is. What an awfully complicated incident. How do you know who that is? You're my hero. I don't remember. Whatever. I don't remember. Yeah, keep it scrolling, keep it scrolling. 
<laughs> Kane Bullet was blackmailing Luke Atme, who was in turn blackmailing Ron. Oh, I know. Okay, never mind. Ron Delight. <laughs> and upon killing his blackmailer, Luke Atme tried to frame Ron Delight. He then claimed to be guilty as Master Mask in order to escape. You gotta his talk to his crime. mommy. Say it again. My apologies. Don't yell at me before I cry. I didn't yell at you. Because <laughs> that end, he came up with this plan. And to that end, he came up with this plan to use the double jeopardy rule when making his alibi. <laughs> alibi. Let's go, Larry. Look at Larry go. At any rate, it would seem we finally found the truth. What the fuck? Who just. It's probably wrong. Excuse I came me. Perilously close to besmirching the record of an innocent young man. Besmirching him with the title of murderer. Oh. Oh my god. Desiree, do something with this nigga, man. I didn't realize you were there. Suck his dick or something, I don't know. Where would he be? <laughs> Breastfeed him. Um, <laughs> Shit, I need one. I mean, huh? I know, you Whoa. never committed any murder. <laughs> That's right, I'm so glad you understand that, but... I'm I, guilty, I, um, thief! I really am Master Mask! Huh? So, thanks to that trial yesterday, I'm innocent now, right? Not again, um, bro. Stop it yourself. Innocent. What was it you said? Double Jeopardy? Now that you mention it... I've been careless. That's insane to me. He said, please try careless. me. Careless? Um... How are you feeling, Sean? <laughs> uh, as the defendant says, the rule of Double Jeopardy is absolute. The defendant can never be tried twice for a crime in which he was found innocent. Then... That nigga really innocent. Yeah, look like it. For now, at least. Unless he does wow. some dumb shit again. For now. He really gets to be innocent of all that millions of dollars shit he stole. Yeah. Yeah, I don't even think it was a million. Mm -hmm. No, the, <laughs> this court finds the defendant. It's only a billion. Yeah! Nice job. And then Ron's like, by the way, I killed Kane Brillard. Fuck y'all. I'm out. Oh, boy, this is really lucky. Wait, uh, I. This isn't so good after all. You see, the thing is, I still have Master Mask after all. Nobody fucking cares anymore! Something <laughs> is so. Number down slow. Good shit, babe! <laughs> babe. Thanks, nigga. It's been a long time, hasn't it? Yeah, it's because Maya doesn't even call me much nowadays, a fucking ass ass hat. Yeah, it's oh. always curly. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm do 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 Watch over her, will you, Phoenix? Cause I bruh. sure I'm not. <laughs> bruh, I'm trying to have kids of my own, bruh. <laughs> but whatever. I guess since it's you, Mia. Well then. Bye bye. You don't get to see her revert back. You no. <laughs> Mia. Uh, Mr. Wright. Um, I uh, I don't know what to say. Well, don't later. Congrats, you did your shit, um, kind of, a little bit, not really, but I mean, I carried. Thank you so much, uh, no, wait, nothing really matters anymore, though, now that all of this has happened. Come on, just be happy already. What the fuck? Maya. You've been clear of the murder oh, charges and got off- You've been clear of the murder charges and got off mask to mask to boot. <laughs> Pull off his mask. But, in exchange, I lost everything. Huh? What do you mean everything? Stealing security yeah, information from KB Security, becoming Master Mask. I did it all for one reason. For her. No, I'm gonna admit. You mean your bitch? <laughs> no, I'm gonna lose her. She hates, she's about to be like... She hates criminals more than anything. Ronnie! Oh, yeah. I can't believe you're getting your cock ripped off to... Ronnie! <laughs> 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 Come to think this of it, she was death. once held hostage by some robbers, wasn't she? <laughs> she always said how she hated sneaky criminals. 
I knew that. Oh, yeah, she I got... knew that, but once I got fired from KB Security and lost all the money I had, she wouldn't have any reason to stay with me. I thought she would leave me for sure. Yeah, for me. Well, that's why he became Master Mask. This nigga Dang, man. man that, <laughs> and that's that when a real nigga is gonna. <laughs> and that's when a real nigga's like me strolls through. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but it's no, all over. Larry already that, tapping. A broken that hole session about can to never be put back together. Tonight. Bro, can y'all shut the fuck up? Your anus. <laughs> Bro, but but the peg session though. You're. This is, this is crucial. <laughs> Sly! Right. I don't care anymore, man. <laughs> We've been, OBS is about to crash at any second. Really? Can we go back to the way things were? Yeah, dude, watch your fucking mouth. You'll be fine, and Nick can prove it. Shut prove up, it, I know you're not talking. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Kinda wish you would check with me first. God damn it, I hate you, Maya. Um, Mr. Delight, even if a bowl is broken, there's always a way to put it back together. Clearly. Here's some paint. Show the paint. <laughs> I'm um, just kidding, show the eye. I don't know, just show him some shit, bro. <laughs> show him okay. some shit. Uh, shoot. The sacred urn? Desi was the one who found this. Desiree, your wife. She always believed in you, Ron. That's why you'll be fine. You don't have to worry about anything. Yeah, ah, there you are. My she favorite part, the, the breakup on. scene. <laughs> the strap right. one is already on. Give mm. him the bad news. Miss D-Light. You did it, Ronnie. You're innocent. I'm so happy. Oh, yeah, I would yeah, pay yeah, to be yeah, this delusional. Thank you. I appreciate <laughs> it. She's like Quilla Ray. But, um, I suppose you, you won't want anything more to do with me, do you? Ronnie? Why didn't you talk to me about what was going on? Cause you like money. I had no idea you'd quit KB Security. Why? <laughs> <laughs> I never imagined that you were really masked to mask either. It's delay. What are you gonna do now that you know? I'm gonna. Ooh. You're not really gonna right. leave him, yes, are you? Yes, what you yes, fucking yes, say that? Yes, what you yes, yes, yes. brain speaks for? Come on. It's obvious, isn't it? How could I ever let a wonderful man like him get away? Fuck! No more for me, God. After all, my bike's really fast. Bruh, they're gonna become criminals together. So fast that there's no way he could ever get away. Oh, she is Clock going to split shit. that ass open. Ain't no dumb oh, coming out of it. But didn't you say that? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> they, not quite the cheeks open. Um, but did you say that uh, you hated criminals? Oh, I only hate people who act all cowardly and sneaky. Bruh, that's literally him. Actually, not like really, since he does send a calling card. Yeah, uh, he did ball like up. Like that detective. <laughs> I see. It's a wrong kind of bullying. Yep, that's how we My do Ronnie it. went and declared his crimes oh, before he committed them. Like a like, man. Like a man. Oh my god. <laughs> I just I will... love a man who's so chivalrous. She is a down ass chick. You gotta respect. She's about to be her. throat baby. For <laughs> real, bro. Oh my. I love both of these two in this case. Miss Prime, I'm going to commit it. I committed it. I gotta watch the anime. I gotta see the sex scene, bro. <laughs> I knew I was right about you. Every day I spend with you is filled with thrills and excitement. Ron gotta be busy. Ezra, you really do love Ron, don't you? That's cool and all, but that's still She weird. just has bad Mickey spending boy. habits. But uh, nobody's perfect. Mm -hmm. What's up? I'm really glad I asked you to defend my Ronnie. Can so I like be a part of what's about to happen? Thank you so much. <laughs> I'll never forget what you've done for us. I mean, I'll watch, you know. You know, you, know, you could be bored at night, you know. I mean, yeah, you know, man, no, don't mention it, man. Don't mention it. <laughs> be a down bad. <laughs> Let me rock. At least let me get I'm a picture. I'm sad right now. Boy. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> you think like you're sweating. It was supposed to right, be the this time. <laughs> Snack, snack, skip, please, please. <laughs> it's like this is all Nick has. He has a freaking minor in Maya. Just, just alive. It pisses me off. <laughs> <laughs> uh.
Talk he's about me ending my life. These are the only women in his life, no matter what happens. Are you talking all that shit, presuming I asked? <laughs> Damn, she slapped him. She beat the shit out of him. Fade to black. He passed out. It was supposed to be me, not him. Lock her ass up. So just as he really, he really got assaulted by a minor. That's crazy. So too did my contract by the minor. Ron said, "A broken bowl can never be put back together." That's some bullshit. (laughs) I mean, just, just look. These niggas suck. <laughs> That's a perfect example of one that put that was put back together even better than before. I mean, I want I want to say that, but I'm you know, lies. That story sucked fucking ass. <laughs> it's okay, <laughs> tables. No tables, you hard care. Who the hell is? Oh no, oh, no, not the maid cafe. I'm quitting this <laughs> it's series. It's clearly mine. <laughs> <laughs>